day has finally come. It's how I know it's time. Oh, dude, I am almost speechless. I am so excited. Today is going to be insane, bro. We're walking in right now. I'm so excited for all the houses. I've been waiting for so long. And, man, oh, obviously, this is gonna be insane. Gonna go, I'm so excited for the houses. It's 4.14 right now. We're just entering. I'm uh, probably gonna get an early entry go. I'm really debating on which one I should do first uh, of the two groups of the weekend, the Legends of Light or Halloween Spirits. Most anticipated, Bugs, Chupacabra, and Winter's Wake. So, I'm so excited for all of Let's go. Dude, here we are, bro. I'm so debating what to go to first, but I'm just gonna have to. This is literally insane. We're to go way to Howie Horror Nights. Like, this is what's insane. I'm so excited. I'm so hyped. All right, we are in. It's looking more towards that we're probably gonna go to the Halloween and Spirits entrance first. But another big thing, I just got express for the whole season. So this is gonna be insane. Oh, I'm so hyped. It's 450, yo, an hour and 40 minutes, bro. This is gonna be insane. Let's go. We are in the line for Halloween and Spirits of the Coven. Stay and scream. This is so exciting. I'm so excited. There you are! Oh, yes! Alright, we're at the entrance for Halloween. It's time, we're about to be Jimmy Fallon of the show. There's the sign for, oh my gosh, first house of the year, Halloween. I'm hyped. Hi, Alright, I've got my first house of the night, Halloween. That was really good. I kind of missed some of the scares. I know I like it way better, but um, soon, but damn, the sets are so dark. Um, that is so good, man. Michael Myers, the ending. Oh, that was so nice. So many good scares. Some of them are just terrifying. It really, that's the movie it very well, but man, big fan of that house. Probably gonna do some more of the soundstage houses. Uh, but I'll probably do this again because we didn't use our express this time, but let's go. All right, so we just got out of Dead Man's Fear, a winter's wait. I love that house. It's absolutely stunning. Best one so far, better than Halloween for sure. Um, yeah, just look absolutely stunning. I got some really good scares. A lot of the scares are really creative. And now we're doing Chupacabra. Super excited for this one, but oh, that was a great house. Uh, I'm excited to keep doing that more and more, but on Chupacabra, excited to see what this one has in store. Another one done, that was Fiesta the Chupacabras. That was really good. Uh, I did like that one. Nine out of 10, my opinion. Um, the Chupacabra, there was actually a decent amount of Chupacabras in it. Definitely towards the end, but that was really fun. Trooper Copper was scary. I I got a lot of scared. It was good. It looked really nice. Uh, really felt like a fiesta. And I'm really impressed with that house. Uh, out of the three I've done, I think I put it in the middle of the pack. Uh, better than Halloween, probably. And probably not as good as Dead Man's Fear, which I think they're all good so far. The ones I've done so far are pretty good ones. So uh, right now we're gonna go do Spirits of the Coven. All right, there's the fourth house done. Just the Spirits of the Coven. Um, definitely uh, my least favorite so far. Uh, I might have missed a couple scares, but really, I mean, it did good. It looked really nice, and it was a long house, but it didn't really give the best scares, in my opinion. I still liked it, but it's the worst, in my opinion, so far. We're going to go over to Hellblock. Um, that one looks decent. Uh, I'm not sure if it would be, like, super good, but the uh, Spirits was good. The theming was nice, but there was one room near the end that got me a really good scare. But, you know, for the scares, it wasn't really that good, but let's go over to Hellblock. Alright, it's a hell block and that was better than I expected. Um, I'd say good scares. I'm not the biggest fan of the prison theme, but that's a good scares. 7.5 I'd probably say. It looked nice. Um, it was it was pretty good. It had some good scares like I just said. And I like Hellblock. Uh, probably so far, fourth favorite. Yeah, just a bum spirit behind the others. But I like that house. I really did. Uh, one house. I'm so excited for this one. Not super excited, but I've watched the black phone. So I kill count freaky, so I'm excited to see what happens. Alright, 
Alright, so I just went through that really cool scare zone. Uh, there was some pretty cool scare because that big show, that was really nice. Uh, but I also did Blum House, which, uh, 7.5 hour, I did that a while ago, but, uh, yeah, Black Phone, definitely better than Freaky. Um, Freaky, I missed a lot of scares, I just didn't get any scares because a lot of scare characters weren't there. But, Blum, uh, Black Phone, when I saw the movie, that was really nice. We're gonna go for the bugs right now, and I am so excited for this one. This is gonna be scary and really fun, so. Stay tuned for my review. Enter pavilion number 31 and see a demonstration of the genius that is Exterminator. All right, wow, just did bugs. Right now we're going to Descendants, but wow, that was really good. 9.5 out of 10. Um, might not have been as scary as I was expecting, but you just got grossed out. There was all sorts of good jump scares. They just get grossed out. There's so many insects. It was so fun. I like that. Now we're doing Descendants. Um, excited for this one. I heard this one's pretty scary, so. Uh, I think this actually probably will be the scariest in my opinion because bugs, I feel like it'd be more scary than bugs because bugs I wasn't actually like that scared of, but let's go do Descendants. Alright, there you go. Descendants of Destruction. Bugs the Sprung Tense done. And that was good. I, I really like that. Um, I got jumped here a couple times. But it wasn't as dumb scary, like the scares weren't the best. I did like it though, it's obviously jump packed like all sprung tents are music. But we're gonna go over and we're gonna go do uh, Weekend and Legends Collide. Those are, that'll be it for the new ones and then we'll redo some of the houses. But uh, that was really, really fun. Um, it really felt like the beginning felt like Seeds of Extinction too. Um, but it looked good and got it, got it, it, was, it was really nice. I, I did like it. Alright, here we are. I kind of forgot to film my reaction to Legends Collide, but I went through both that and the weekend. Uh, first star of Legends Collide, I, you can hear the music right there. That was really good. Uh, it's been a while since I went through. Man, that was so good. I got so many scares uh, at the end, it's always different, so I got the mummy uh, winning this time, but it was decent. Um, I, I really love Legends Collide. That's one of my favorite set of the events so far. Uh, 9.5 is the score I gave it. And then we went through, right after that we went to the weekend. Um, a little disappointed, I mean, it was decent. I'll give it an eight out of 10. But I think they should have utilized some of the stuff better. They didn't have any big scares. They didn't have the frog a lot, which I think the frog was pretty scary, but uh, it was decent. It's mid tier, probably like seven. So I rank it, can't even see my face, but still. Uh, now we've completed all the houses, so that's great. We're probably gonna go do Chupacabra and the weekend because we haven't used those express passes yet. And then we'll probably leave recapping the night, but great night so far. All right, and that'll do it for the night of Halloween Horror Nights. Um, we just did two more houses. Uh, we did Halloween and Fiesta de Chupacabras. And in both of them, we got some good space like in front of us. We like almost no, like, and we got so many scares, uh, and it was awesome. Halloween, I got almost every scare. I love that house so much. Uh, maybe at the end of this video, I'll put my rankings of the, of the houses. That was so good. And look at Chupacabra. That puppy is, pup, not puppy, <laughs> which is puppy, but that puppet is so scary. Uh, and also we got no people in front of us too on that one. And it's just stunning, the costume design, the audio. That house is so good. The OGs this year were so nice. Yeah, I mean, I mean, just if you just sit and look around, like it is just stunning. Drew the Copper was. So that'll be do it for tonight at Halloween Horror Nights. Um, this year's event is really nice. Um, I probably will not be posting any more vlogs on my YouTube about this event, but definitely on my story on Instagram. Uh, so go check that out. Of course, I'll be going here so many times this year. 15, or maybe not 15, but so many times. And just stay tuned for more. I uh, love this is a great year, another great year for Halloween Horror Nights.
So stay tuned until next time. Oh, I'm not the one.